The solar eclipse is now just one week away, and with that, vendors are scamming people with some fake eclipse glasses. As our 18 News reporter Joe Mason found out, the eclipse also looks different for people watching across the globe. That's right, Trina. Good evening. Millions of people across the country and the world will be watching the total solar eclipse, but it's important to have the right glasses. They have to be like these ones and ISO certified. With the total eclipse just a week away on April 8th, we decided to look at a few questions you might be wondering about. What areas will have a total solar eclipse? Places located in what's called the path of totality, like Buffalo and Montreal. Essentially, that is the place where the moon's shadow is passing over the surface of the Earth. So the people within that path of totality will be people in parts of Mexico, the USA, and southeastern Canada as well. Other people outside of those regions may well see a partial solar eclipse. Elmira will have a partial solar eclipse with the sun being covered 98% by the moon. It'll begin around 2.07 in the afternoon. Maximum coverage will happen around 3.22. So what does a solar eclipse look like? What they'll see over the course of two hours or so is the moon very slowly moving across the face of the sun, sort of looking like it's almost eating the sun out of the sky. And when it reaches that point of totality, it will be darker, it will be colder as well, because the moon is not only blocking the sun's light, it's blocking its warmth. What will happen if you stare at the sun without those special glasses? The sun's UV radiation is capable of destroying the soft tissue in the back of your eyeballs. It's not very nice. It can cause severe and sometimes permanent damage to your vision. So if you are viewing the solar eclipse directly, you're going to need solar eclipse glasses. And how can you tell your glasses are the real deal? It's hard to tell the difference. Um, you do want to make sure that they're ISO certified. Also, um, looking on the inside of the, of the paper glasses, there's a lot of information showing the certifications. Now, I put these on, but they're very dark, as you'll see. But we already have a few stories on next week's eclipse, but we'll have even more as the week goes on.